How's that heat pump working out for you, my friends in Maine? Such a scam, such a scam. I hope uh, you didn't sacrifice all sorts of heating for your stupid heat pump. Oh, my goodness. All right, let's take a look. Maine, Mainers urged to prepare for extreme cold. The coldest has been since 2016. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We don't need firewood. We got a heat pump. Who needs firewood when we got a heat pump? Hey, crazy. The MEMA, Maine Emergency Management Agency, is urging Mainers to prepare for the extreme cold weather. Uh, said wind chills will plunge temperatures in the negative 30s and 40s. The cold temperatures that we're expecting on Friday and Saturday happen only about once a decade. Oh, boy. So we're urging Mainers. This is the time you want to be indoors, you think? Uh, pets should only be let outside briefly, and livestock owners should check to make sure the water doesn't freeze. Officials are urging Mainers to check on neighbors, friends, and family. If local warming and charging centers open, they'll be listed on the agency's website. Don't let us comment. So let's go over here. Can we comment here? This is the main... Yeah, I guess not. <laughs> anyway, so let's just take a gander. As long as your house is properly air sealed and insulated, an air source heat pump can perform well beyond temperatures of negative 13 degrees Fahrenheit. If you live in extreme cold, you may need to use a supplemental heat or what's called dual fuel system. Of course, these are all the propagandists who say, oh, heat pumps will be fine. It's going to be fine. Can heat pumps actually work? The consumers right here. Heat pump, let's look at this guy right here. Heat pumps can work in all types of weather. Uh, if you've never owned this since before, you might wonder, will a heat pump work in the cold weather? The answer is yes, provided the installation is done correctly. In some cases, you might need to pair with a backup heat source. Yeah. Um, <laughs> the, the scam level of heat pumps is beyond uh, words, man. It's, uh, and that's what they're doing in Britain right now. And they're wanting to switch you out from your freaking gas stove. Oh, my goodness. Gas stoves, asthma, asthma. It's, it's such a freaking scam. This whole thing's a scam. I have natural gas here. In, I live in Georgia, by the way. As you're wondering, my hair's a mess. Oh, well, deal with it. Uh, you don't want a heat pump. Now, look, I got a heat pump. I live in Georgia. All right. We also have warming. Isn't we Actually, we have heat pump by air conditioning. Do we have a heat pump? We got natural gas as our warming mechanism. So I guess we don't have a heat pump. I don't even know what I got. I, when we lived in Texas, we had a heat pump. But the, the issue wasn't the cold weather. The issue was, was air conditioning. But the problem is all it takes is a freaking 24 hours to freeze to death and you're dead. And your pipes to freeze to burst yeah, this is there's no joke cold is a killer and if you're relying on uh photovoltaic solar and wind you're freaking nuts electricity is not a good uh source of generation uh, electricity is not a good source of free heat it's just not it's dumb heat pumps rely on electricity you need good old-fashioned fossil fuels so tell that to Jan Janet Mills and those fools up there in your freaking stupid state legislature. Stop the destruction of human beings via heat pumps. Ah, so frustrating. I will right, we'll see you.